Hi guys, it's Saturday and I was really unsure if I was going to make a video today because I have been dying of homework this weekend and last weekend and I was just dying and I didn't know what to make a video about and uh, like I haven't even watched Doctor Who which is like airing now Either way, I found out I wanted to make a quick video about the last books I bought uh, it's not like I'm not the one going out and buy like 17 books at once. I like buy one book here, one book here. Sometimes it can be a lot and sometimes... Okay, it's really a lot all the time, but I'm trying to not to overbuy. I'm not really good at it, but I'm trying. Um, so some of these books I actually bought like before the summer and I made a video about it, but I never posted it because I just hated it. Uh, so I'm gonna take this book in now. And just like talk a bit about them, what they are about, and what I expect from them. So let's start. So, the island by Victoria His Hislop. Hislop. I can't even. I can't do this. Um, it's uh, a book I heard so much about because like. My whole family read it, and everyone is like, oh my god, it's so good, you have to read it. And I was going to, but then the copy we had disappeared, and I was like, okay, so then I just, now I bought it. Uh, in English, though, the others, they read it in Norwegian. They are losers! So, it is about uh, Spinalonga, which was an island, a Greek island, uh, where they put people with a lepra sickness back in the days. Is it called lepra in English? Leper. Leper. The former leper colony. It's something like that. It's a... And either way it's supposed to be really exciting about that island. It's called an island though. And uh, a really good, a good, like, it's gotten so much good things. So I'm really looking forward to reading it. I just hope I will get my ass to read now though. And then we have The Silence by Tim Lieben and it's really funny because I never heard anything about this book when I bought it. I just went in the store and I needed to switch something up for my birthday and I was like, oh, this looks cool and then I read behind it and I was like, oh, it sounds cool, let's just buy it, that's me. And uh, it's, it's about like, um, 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 uh, if you make sounds you die or something, I don't really know and there's main character is deaf. So he's like, lives in silence, he's used to it. Or is it she? Oops, it was a her. Sorry! <laughs> and uh, yeah, it just sounds cool, like it could be really good, but maybe it also sucks, who knows. Uh, so yes. And then it was this book we all looked up. I think it's, isn't that popular now? I don't even know. And uh, then they're like, I don't even know what this is about either really. Um, uh, it's more like, this is a really good video. Is an asteroid coming and then something happens with the people which were typical in groups before but now they can do whatever they want to before the end. I don't even know what that's supposed to mean. I should maybe I read this on the internet but I want to not spoil myself and uh, I think it's supposed to be really good. So yeah. I forgot what the author was named. It's We All Looked Up by Tommy Volka. And um, uh, yes, it just it 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 it, 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 it looks good. Let's let's just see about that, yeah. And then we have uh, Los Peregrinos. I can I can't pronounce this by Cecilia Samartin. I met this art actually twice, and she was awesome. And uh, yes, this is Norwegian because I have all our other books in Norwegian. And um, this is the third book in a series, and I read the two first ones. Uh, I really like the first one. The second one was really weird at the ending, and let's see what this brings us. Uh, this author is so great. She is amazing, and I really love her books, so I just had to get this, obviously. Then we have Girl Online by So Sook. Uh, and I know that <laughs> I think everyone has heard about Zoe, which is a famous YouTuber, and she wrote this book, and I think the sequel is coming soon. And I just wanted to read it, even though it sounds a bit cliche and it doesn't sound really original. Uh, there's just a girl who writes a blog, and then she meets a guy. <laughs> but it looks cute, huh? I just wanted to read it, and like, why not? Yay! And we have 
Vicious. Isn't that vicious? Vic vicious? Vicious? By V E Schwab. <laughs> And um, mm, 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 that's about two boys who um, did something wrong and then 10 years later he's out of prison and then I meet again or something. Uh, I don't really know what this is about either. It was just like I was going to have a birthday present and I was like, which book? No, she was like, which book do you want? And I'm like, I don't know. Uh, do you have any suggestions? And then she just says this and she was like, oh my god, it's so good. And I was like, bye to me then. So um, I really trust her, um, what's it called? Instincts about books. We have been books friends for life forever. We met through books. I trust that this is a good book. And uh, yeah. It also looks cool. Like, mm. Oh god, what is that? Yeah. Then we have The Girl on the Train, which I guess everyone has heard about these days. It's really popular. And it's about this girl who's on a train and then one day something weird happens. And I don't know what it, that happens is. A lot of people have... Uh, compared it to Gone Girl. I read Gone Girl and I wasn't that impressed by it. It was good, but could be better. Uh, so who knows what this will bring. I just really wanted to read it because what's the hype? I want to be on the hype train, yes. And I even forgot the authors by Paula Hawkins. Paula Hawkins, yes. Uh, uh, and then we have two Norwegian books. This is Trolle and the Magiske Fela. It me basically means Trolle, which is a troll. Uh, and a magical violin in English. It's a children's book by Alexander Ryback, which is my favorite babe. Favorite artist is a Norwegian artist. He won the Eurovision Song Contest in 2009. He was the guy who had a poster on and a background before and I had another angle. And he wrote this children's book and then there is like CDs. Eh, eh, CDs there and CDs here. Uh, the tree cedars that where they, the book is read and there also the music to it and it's just so cute and I just had to buy it because like even though it's a children's book why not and it looks cute and like I just had to it had gotten really good critics I critics I can't even speak so like yay uh, another Norwegian book by Dungset and Eliasen and it's called En Mørkere Himmel also in Norwegian, in Norwegian, in English, that is a darker sky, I guess. And Eliasen, or Ruben Eliasen, it's his whole name, Ruben, I can't even speak. He is my favorite author of all time. He has been my favorite author since I was a kid. And that is the only reason I bought this book. It's a crime book, and I don't, I'm not really a big fan of crime, even though I read it sometimes. And uh, I just... I wrote this with his wife. I think that's his wife, yes. And it just it's set on Gran area, which is an island uh, I've been to a lot. So that is, I think that's really cool because he, he, he lived there for a while. And I was like, I've been there too. We can meet, but he didn't answer. No, I didn't say that. I'm joking. That was my book. Not a big book haul. This is like bought over time, but um, still books. And looking forward to read all of them. And yes. So I just really wanted to talk about books. I have this book hype, but now after this video is done, I'm gonna go and read it. Yeah. I don't know. Okay, I'm just really sorry for this video. Uh, I'm tired and I am. Blah. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Subscribe, um, like, and talk to me about books, please. And I will see you all the next Saturday. I'm actually thinking a <coughs> secret that I'm gonna make maybe a bonus video this week about Tutu Who or something because I just have this feeling. We will see how much time I have. I'm gonna I'm gonna end this video now. I think it's bye.